Hey, Camp Hawks. We are at Fiesta Key RV Resort and Marina in Layton, Florida. We're in the Florida Keys. We'll take you around this campground. Here, Here we, we go. go. I'm Missy. I'm Mike. And we're in the Camp Cable Hawks, it's awful windy out here. I want to give you a shot of our site. This is site 233. Give you an idea, I'll give you a perspective of the size of the site. This is a standard site. Got enough room to, uh, you got enough room to have a yard if you didn't park your truck in the, in the yard or your little smart car. Comes complete with a little sidewalk. And it is 50 amp, 30 amp. And 20 amp pedestal here. You'll, you'll see it. So you got plenty of room around your sewer. There's your connections, your standard sewer connection block. But the pedestal is nowhere near your hookup side. So the pedestal is to the rear of your unit. Now, this is another campsite right here. Site 332. They went back in right here. And this is their site, their pad. That's their picnic table. And but this is site 332 right behind us. There's Echo. So here's your water connection. I'm gonna go try to find a patch of grass. Oh yeah, she's gonna go look for a patch of grass. So here's your connections. This is a big power pedestal. And your water pressure, and I got a water pressure setting on there. But this is it. There is no grass on your site. It is all rock. Just be advised. If you got a pet, you got to walk it over there to a little that little spot of grass for your pet to go. Give you a tour of the campground now. All right, Camper Hawks, we're here with Jessica Frey, who is the manager of Fiesta, Fiesta Key RV Resort. So give us a little background about you. How'd you get there? So I actually come from, I'm a hotelier. I um, have about 12 to 14 years in hotel experience. Okay. Um, I was actually an area revenue manager for four Alamrata resorts that were here in Alamrata. And then I was looking at possibly, I was born and raised here, so I've never left the Keys. I'm a true conch. Wow. <laughs> Can you explain the difference in the classification of the sites? You know, the, you have the premium, the elites, and the standards. Can you tell? Absolutely. Can you tell the viewers about what the difference may be? Sure. So the standard sites are back-end sites only, um, and they you get put in a standard site when you book based on the size of your rig. So if you have a 35-foot rig, you're going to get put into a 35-foot site, not a 45-foot site. So mm -hmm. we guarantee site type, so standard, premium, or elite. Um, and then premium is mostly pull through, but we do have some premium sites that are in cap sites because they are bigger and wider. Okay. So those are premium pricing and those are in cap sites. Um, and then our elite sites are all waterfront. And what waterfront means is you could have an ocean view or you could be on the water. Okay. You could be on the canal or you could have a full blown ocean view. Mm -hmm. um, 
option either way you're on the water if you booked an elite site you can see the water whatever it might be but all of our elite sites which we don't have very many of um, are all pretty much anything on the water hotel side of it right so now we have 50 rentals um, and we had 274 sites so altogether about 324 altogether okay. um, and then we have 44 new sites that are underway in the middle of the construction over here mm -hmm. um, in that prime real estate area um, so all in in total we're gonna have somewhere around 318 sites Wow In your humble opinion, what do you want families to take away from their experience here? Memories. Memories, family time. Um, you know, when, when guests leave here, they take away memories. <laughs>